freaking morning but how are y'all doing i'm currently on the road right now i'm on my way to my wax appointment today is going to be a very busy day for me i have a lot to do a lot of errands to run i just came back from getting my nails done you guys saw the whole process of that you saw me get my nails done you know all that good stuff so i'm gonna go get waxed after i get waxed i'm going to go drop off my wig to my stylist because i get my hair done tomorrow for my birthday this is just horrible. I didn't even introduce the video. <laughs> like, I'm so sorry, y'all. I'm really sorry. I'm all over the place today. So, please forgive me. But, my birthday is in two days. So, of course, we have to prepare for that. I gotta feel like the bad B that I am. Although, I'm not doing anything for my birthday. I still need to feel like, you know, like it's my birthday. Right now, like, complete shit. Like, it's like I always look like shit. But, stay tuned for the glow up tomorrow because when i get my wig it's over for these hoes i didn't do anything to my head this morning i just came out how i woke up i ain't put no gel in it no nothing i got a bunch of white stuff in my hair like everything is just a mess as far as my head as y'all can see but asking do i care though because i don't i know this angle is a really bad angle so i apologize i couldn't really get my tripod to stand up in the car like I usually do because it's broken. I've been talking about my birthday for the past two weeks it feels like. It's like every video I've done I've mentioned my birthday and now that my birthday well by the time y'all watch this my birthday has already passed. It's actually now Valentine's Day so I get spoiled twice. I'm starving. I haven't ate all day. Y'all saw me wake up at the crack of ass because I had class. All oh, that rhyme crack of ass drive you guys and i'll just see you all once we get to our destination so you guys will honestly never believe what the hell i just did so i had the wrong address in my gps and i was five minutes away from my location which wasn't my location and i'm looking at like where i'm at and i'm like i should not be over here like where the hell am i and so I went to go look at the address, and it was the fucking wrong address. I am all the way on another side of town, and I'm pissed. I'm fucking pissed. I am 20 minutes away from my destination that I need to be at. I remember putting the address in my GPS when I was getting my nails done so I could see how far away from it I was and I'm like all right I think this is the address so I'm gonna just you know go ahead and take this route but I should have freaking made sure that was the correct address so I had to hop back on the beltway and take another 20 minute ride so I've been driving for 40 fucking minutes I don't even know what to say I'll see y'all when I get there y'all I am stuck under a fucking tunnel it's traffic I don't even know how I got Oh my god, the left lane is closed And I'm in the left lane I need to get, oh, Jesus Where's my mom? Like, where is she? I don't know how I got here I'm surprised she hasn't called me Like, she usually checks my location I'm surprised she ain't called me and be like Why are you all the way over there? Like, oh god. I need to get out of this tunnel Two hours later, y'all, I fucking made it. Let's go in. I just got finished with my wax. I like it not taking him too long to pull in a parking spot. And he has a backup camera. I don't understand what's taking me so long. Now I am about to go ahead and drop off my wig to my stylist because I was going to go do that after I got my lashes done, but she said she's not going to be there, so. I'm about to go ahead and drop my wig off first and then go get my lashes done and then go back home. But first, I have not ate all day, so I am about to go get some food 
the closest thing that I found is a Burger King. So that's where I'm about to go. I don't really care for Burger King that much, but honestly, I gotta eat something before I croak over and pass out. I've been up since seven. No food in my stomach. No nothing. It sucks that I don't have a car tripod because it's so hard to drive like this. Like, it's, it's so annoying. Hello, thank you for choosing Burger King. I may help you. Hi, can I get a number seven? Would you like the little with cheese or without? With. Would you like the little small, medium, or large? Small. And a drink? Lemonade. Lemonade. Would you like anything else? No. Oh, uh, right side 71 is your soda first winner. Thank you. Hello. Thank you. So I got my food. I'm gonna take a few bites out of this because I'm starving. Mm -hmm. So I got a Junior Whopper and fries and a lemonade. I'm about to go ahead and drop my wig off and I will let y'all know when I'm there. All right, y'all, so we made it to drop my wig off. Sorry, excuse the sun. But before I go and drop it off, I wanted to show you guys it. So this video is sponsored by Ali Pearl here. And this is their 30 inch straight wig. Yes, y'all. 30 mother inch, baby. Don't believe me? Look at it. Look at it. I touched the hair already. I looked at the lace. Everything seems to be perfect. But I can't really give too much information until I get it installed. So let's go ahead and drop her off. Damn, the fuck this shit is locked? Uh, excuse me. Uh, I don't know how to get in here. Bro, what the fuck? This shit is dumb. Wig is dropped off. Now it's time for lashes. And the bad B that she is is back. Get into the big blinks. We didn't do a classic set this time. We did a hybrid, and I love them so much. And hybrids should actually last longer than a classic set because she told me with a classic set, a lash isn't like on each lash in a way. So that's why I like the retention or something like that. That's why it don't last long. But I got a hybrid set, so. They're much thicker, much fuller, and I love them so much. And yeah, so we got our lashes done today. We got our nails done. We dropped our wig off tomorrow, which is Tuesday. We go get our wig installed, and I'm also gonna get my toes done. So I feel like this video was kind of like all over the place. So if it was, I'm gonna give you a quick little rundown of what happened today. So this morning I woke up, my car was frozen with ice because it snowed the previous day and no one insisted on cleaning my window off so i forgot in the morning so when it's time for me to get my nails done um i couldn't sit there and wait for it to defrost so i had to try with snow on my windshield i cleaned it the best way i could but it didn't really wasn't really safe but thank god i made it there safely and in time and by the time I got to my friend's house, because she's my friend, make sure y'all go follow her and go get your nails done by my girl, Ken. But by the time I got to her house, the windshield was, like, kind of defrost or whatever. So, it was easy for me to just wipe it off with my notebook, like you guys saw in the very first clip. So, I also had school this morning from 7.30 to 9. After school, I went to go get my nails done. After my nail appointment, I went to go get a wax when I took the wrong way and I was stuck in traffic for about 45 damn minutes. But we made it. We went there and we got it. After my wax appointment, I was supposed to go get my lashes done, but I had to drop my wig off to my stylist because she was not going to be at her shop all day. So I had to go all the way out the direction of my lash appointment to go drop my wig off. And then after that, 
is when I went to get my lashes done. After my lashes was done, I am home now. I have to finish up some homework. And then I'm going to take a shower and go to bed. Mm, a lot. I have to take my hair out. Forgot. <clears throat> this is going to be my new filming spot for whenever I'm in the bathroom. Because this is bomb. It's not on a tripod. It's on a little, like, two-piece holder. Thank you, Bubba. Yeah. So, I'm in the bathroom for the first time to take out my hair. Interesting location. This shouldn't be that hard, though. Because it's just like a twist braid thing wrapped around a ponytail i'm super tired i do not feel like washing my hair i just washed my hair literally last week and i have to wash it again because look at this y'all it look like you don't want to know what it look like oh see what i'm saying that's why i spoke too soon and then i have my nails on so it's kind of hard for me to grip. Yeah. I'm just going to cut it because I don't have time for this bullshit. Okay. I am starving. I am sleepy. I need to take a shower. You guys want to know what's so fun about my birthday? I'm supposed to come on my cycle. They, well, not supposed. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. I'm coming on my cycle the day of my birthday or the day before i don't know hopefully it's the day before because i do not want to be on my cycle like exactly on my birthday well i want to be on there regardless but i don't want to come on that day you know i'd rather just come on the day before and it'll be over quicker versus me damn Versus me coming on my birthday and it's left so longer. Oh, Y'all, look at all of this. Like, gunk. Oh, hell no. That is trifling. Get the shit off my fucking hair. I probably kept the fucking bugs and shit. Get out. <clears throat> Probably shouldn't be doing this, but who gives a hell? Ah, my nail keep getting stuck. Oh. Can I just pull it out? <laughs> ah, there we go. Easy peasy in the squeezy. <gasps> oh my god, y'all ever seen um whatchamacallit uh, who is that Arthur and you know like the yellow guy I can't think of his name but he looks like weird or something next time I do my ponytails I'm gonna use um gorilla glue so it can stay stuck on my head for months say so, no that's not funny though I really hope that girl fixes her situation because that is very ah shit that is very dangerous and I'm concerned. I really want to know how her scalp is doing and her well-being, of course. Ah, I know that scalp a little bit tender. Oh, child, my hair is gulped up and stiff in my mugshot. edges I thought they were slick this side is slick but this side is not let's just go wash this shit I ain't got time look at my cat in the back sleep y'all say hi she's not really a people's cat oh here she comes she's coming oh shit say hi mama say hi say hi to the royalty babies say hi she said hello you all anywho i am about to go wash my hair of course cj shampoo well i don't know if it's shampoo or the conditioner but it's her products 
she's also sending me more thank you jesus my mama been stealing my stuff so she's been using it hold on because where the other one what is this 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 the shampoo where's my conditioner i know it ain't downstairs yeah. so i can't find my conditioner so i'm assuming it's still downstairs from the last time i washed my hair which was a week ago but y'all should know the products that I use by now. CJ shampoo and conditioner. If you don't know, go watch my girl talk. I went through all of my hair care products that I use. So I'm about to go wash my hair and I will come back because you don't need to see me wash my hair or blow dry my hair. Cause y'all see that all the time. But I'ma probably talk to you guys after I get out the shower or before, I don't know yet. You guys probably can't see me that good, but I washed and blow dried my hair. I'm super tired now, so I'm getting ready to go to bed. I also got school in the morning. I also got a lot of things to do tomorrow. I need to go to the store, I need to go get my toes done, go get my hair done. My hair appointment is from 2 o'clock to like 5 o'clock, so yeah, time schedule is a little bit limited. I'm thinking about going to get my toes done when I wake up in the morning and then going to the store and then coming back home. I wash my hair, y'all, and for some reason, it feels, like, greasy. Like, I don't know if I didn't wash it good enough or something was on my brush. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't feel like washing it again in the morning time. But that's what it's looking like I'm going to do. I'm going to see, like, if I sleep on it and it just come out on a pillow or something that sounds trifling as hell but and if not then i guess i'll just rewash it in the morning and do this whole process over again but that completes day one of our birthday transformation now tomorrow is the final review so i'll see y'all when we wake up good night good morning y'all and welcome to day two of my birthday preparations as you walk and see, I just have my hair, like, tied back in this little bun, whatever you want to call it. So, I decided not to wash my hair again because, I don't know, I just didn't. I mean, it doesn't feel like how it felt last night, so I think that's okay. And I have went to points with my hair like this multiple times before. So, I think I'm fine. I guess I should be. I don't know. Time check, it is 10.02 a.m. My appointment for my hair is at 2 o'clock, if I haven't mentioned that already. I'm about to throw some clothes on, brush my teeth, and go get my nails done. Well, not my nails, my toes done, because... Look at this, I'm going to show y'all. Hunty, I don't know what this is like. No, I get the acrylic big toe and my acrylic big toe on both of my toes came off because it's been a long time so i'm gonna get a new one and i'm thinking about getting the french tip pedicure that's what i want because i think it's really really classy after i leave the nail salon i'm going to go to target because i need to go get some like hygiene products i'm also going to film a hygiene video and after i come home from target i will be home and then i'm going to wait for my Appointment? No. While I'm at Target, I'm going to go to the ATM machine and get some money out the bank to pay for my hair. Once my hair is done, I'm supposed to get a phone today. My mom's going to buy me the iPhone 12, so I don't know when she plans on taking me to do that. Maybe after I get my hair done or something. It feels like every time the new phones come out, your old phone starts to, well, your, not your old phone, your current phone starts to act up. And mine has just really been tripping, like, too much and... I don't do that. I be trying to call people. It don't call. I be trying to send money. The money don't send. I be trying to text. My phone will black out. It's just too much going on. And I don't need it in my life right now. So, but yeah, I'm about to go ahead, throw some clothes on, go brush my teeth, and we're going to head out. Shazzy, that's my dog. But pull, you know I'm very shy.
We arrived. Let's go get these two sleep. So I just finished up in the nail salon. I am about to go to Target to grab a few products and then I'll be on my way back home. Yeah, I really think I have like dementia or something. I keep going into these stores with no mask on. Like, I don't know what it is. Oh, my car all the way over here. I just keep forgetting. Now I have to go walk all the way back to my car. I was wondering why the old lady staring at me. I'm like, why is she looking at me like that? Just playing no mask on. <laughs> Mind you, not having a mask on is ja embarrassing. Just due to the fact that you gotta have this on. And if you don't have it on, it's like you're. I was gonna really say spreading some wild disease, but you really are. But I'm here now at Target with my mask on. So we made it to the hair appointment, y'all. I'm super excited. Let's go get slayed. All right, y'all. Now I'm getting ready to get this lovely, beautiful black 30 inch wig from ali pro installed by my girl adrienne aka my auntie follow her on instagram at a beauty bar if you follow me on instagram i tagged her in my pics and ali pro so y'all can you know see how the result came already anyway so i'm gonna get my hair done you know she does the ball cap method we put it on all that good stuff as you're as you're watching this you're going to see what she does so i'm just coming to check in with y'all to give y'all a little voice over okay because I haven't done this in a really long time and I want to do it anyway. But yeah, this is my birthday wig. It was super, super cute. It came from Ali Pro Hair. It's the 30 inch Brazilian straight wig. If you want a very affordable wig, make sure you guys go follow them on all their social media platforms. Follow them on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. If they have a Twitter, the link to their website will be in the description box below. And you guys can also go purchase this wig or another wig of your choice. This was my favorite because I had it and I still have it in today. And it's really, really cute. And I love it so much. So thank you, Ali Pearl, for sponsoring today's video. And stay tuned to see the outcome. All right, you guys. So I am back from the hair salon. Well, not the hair salon, but, you know, getting my hair done is super, super cute. I love it. Y'all can't really see, but... <coughs> I'm out of breath. I just came back in the house I'm running. I got so much to do after I close out this video. But this is my hair. I got some loose curls, 30 inches. This is the HD lace frontal wig from Ali Pearl Hair, 30 inches straight. Look at the lace. Get into it. Oh, I thought a bitch you ain't had 30 inches, so. Um, um, the birthday girl birthday is tomorrow. It's exciting. I'll be 19. Grown is thick. Grown is thick. thick, thick. But alright though. For real. On to this hair though. So this hair is silky as F. I love the like inches. I haven't had 30 inches in a very long time. And I'm glad I got it back because this is super, super cute. The lace is really, really good. As you go up and tell by the way the edges are. You know, everything is good. Part is straight. I have no complaints about the hair literally whatsoever. I love it. I can't wait to take pictures. It's super, super soft. The shipping was fast as hell also. So shout out to Ali Pearl for definitely getting me right for my birthday. I'm about to cry. I'm about to be 18. And this hair is so freaking cute. I just look so freaking good. Ali Pearl, y'all did y'all thing. We y'all send me this 30 inch wig. It is a wig if I didn't say it already. It's a 30 inch wig. 30 inch, 30 inch, 30 inch Brazilian straight wig. Make sure y'all go shop with them. Everything to this hair will be linked down in the description box below. As you all just seen, you saw me actually getting the wig installed, etc. It's style and everything was just flawless. When she was blow drying it, it wasn't getting stuck nowhere. Everything was bomb. No back complaints. One of the best hairs I ever had. No cap. Alright you guys, so I'm getting ready to go ahead and close out this video because I do have a lot to do. And that is actually the end of my birthday preparation. I got my nails done, got my lashes done, got my hair done. And now the show is on tomorrow for whatever we have planned for today. So I love you all. Thank you all for watching and also thank you all for the birthday wishes. I love you all so much and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!